When you're talking about a product, a lot of people, especially people that are high R&D focused, they want to talk about the features, and why wouldn't you? You spend a long time working on them and making them possible. The problem is the customers don't understand. Think for a second to the MP3 market. Does that, did anyone own an MP3 player? Yeah, okay. That market was incredibly fierce. There were so many organizations out there. We have the one gig MP3 player, the three gig MP3 player. People spent fortunes on R&D to launch the five gig MP3 player. We have the ability to fast forward better. We have shock proofing. There are so many different little features that people had. The market was crazy competitive. People were spending fortunes on separating them and their brand. And then Apple launched with a thousand songs in your pocket and the market exploded. Simply, people could understand that. What, how many songs do I get for a gig? What is a gig? I mean, this was back in 2000 and, well, 1998, where people were still trying to get the hang of technology. But they did understand everybody had those big walls of CDs. And they knew they didn't have a thousand songs in that wall of CDs. They just knew it took up the entire wall. And now I can have it in my pocket. People just all of a sudden got it. And that's why there were lines out the doors of every Apple shop. Stop selling on features, price, and discounts. People want a message that they can identify with. And for that, they will pay a premium. So think, what is your message?